and casino operator El Dorado Resorts has agreed to merge with Caesars. It's a cash and stock deal. El Dorado buying Caesars for $12.75 per share. Works out to about $8.6 billion. That's the headline price tag. But it excludes debt, we should say, because there's a lot of debt there. They will retain the Caesars name upon completion of the deal. I think that makes sense. Caesars is a bigger name than El Dorado. The combined company uh, will be the largest owner and operator of U.S. gaming assets. Caesar has been under activist and pressure, activist pressure from Carl Icahn, who was awarded seats on Caesars board earlier this year. So What's this the practical it. impact you think of this? Not a big one. Yeah. I mean, it's just more consolidation in a space that probably needs it. More beyond this, you think? More beyond, you're saying, well, are there more? There's not that many. I mean, some of the small guys will get together, but Caesars, that's, that was part of the issue. The Caesars needed something. That's, and that's what Carl Icahn was saying for a long time. So he basically got what he wanted. He got this. what he wanted. Carl Icahn is the winner today.